Blackfacts.com presents Sigma Pi Phi Fraternity, also known as the Bool, narrated by Timbuktu. This video features about Sigma Pi Phi Fraternity, the first Greek letter society for African Americans. Founded on May 15, 1904, Sigma Pi Phi Fraternity, also known as the Boule, which in ancient Greece was a council of chiefs, is the oldest continuously existing Greek letter postgraduate fraternity originally founded by, and primarily for, eminent black professional men and later similar professional men of African descent throughout the world. Its founders were six exceptional men, four medical doctors, one dentist and one pharmacist, who at that time was a second-year medical school student. They were Henry McKee Minton, a registered pharmacist and second-year student at Philadelphia, Pennsylvania's Jefferson Medical School, Algernon B. Jackson, M.D., the first African-American graduate of the Jefferson Medical School, Edwin Clarence Joseph Turpin Howard, M.D., who in 1869 was one of the first two black graduates of the Harvard Medical School, Richard John Warwick, D.D.S., a graduate of the Philadelphia School of Dental Surgery, Eugene Theodore Hinson, M.D., a graduate of the University of Pennsylvania School of Medicine, and Robert Jones Abiel, M.D., the first black graduate of Philadelphia's then Hanneman Medical College, which is now Drexel University College of Medicine. In its early years and throughout most of its existence, Sigma Pi Phi Fraternity was a quiet, secret organization. Today the fraternity can be considered private and, as was the case during its early years of existence, it avoids self-perpetuating publicity. Yet, throughout its life, in addition to the personal strength derived from the camaraderie shared by its members, the fraternity has embraced and remains committed to enhancing and elevating black communities by striving to eliminate barriers therein to civic, social, political, educational, and economic well-being through its social action programs and public policy initiatives. Growth of the fraternity since its founding has been deliberately slow as it was not conceived to be a large, indiscriminate body of men. Rather, the emphasis of membership has always been on quality, not quantity. From an initial membership of six founders located in the city of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, Sigma Pi Phi Fraternity has grown to presently include over 5,000 active members who are affiliated with 139 member boules, located throughout the United States and in the Bahamas and the United Kingdom. Throughout its existence its membership has included some of the most distinguished men in the world. They have included such scholars and academic, cultural, and civil rights leaders as W.E.B. Dubois, Carter G. Woodson, founder of the Association for the Study of African American Life and History, Charles R. Drew, physician who developed blood plasma, James Weldon Johnson, author of Lift Every Voice and Sing, L. Douglas Wilder, the first elected black governor of a U.S. state, and Martin L. King Jr., founder of the Southern Christian Leadership Conference, and one of the most important 20th century civil rights leaders. The number of black U.S. congressmen have been members of Sigma Pi Phi fraternity including Charles B. Rangel, Andrew J. Young Jr., and later U.S. Ambassador to the United Nations and Mayor of the City of Atlanta, Georgia, and James E. Clyburn, as well as two recently deceased members of Congress, Representatives John R. Lewis, and Elijah E. Cummings. Members of the fraternity whose contributions are noteworthy in the arts and humanities include Hale A. Woodruff, Arna W. Bontomp, Ulysses S. K. and Ollie W. Wilson Jr., jazz greats William E. Taylor Jr., and Winton L. Marsalis, and Francis E. Harper. Sigma Pi Phi's present membership continues to include an impressive list of leaders in a broad range of professional fields of endeavor including, but not limited to, education, law, medicine, science, economics, public service, civil rights, and the arts and humanities. Importantly, since 1912 the fraternity has published the Boule Journal, that chronicles new and ongoing social action and public policy programs and initiatives created and supported within the ranks of the fraternity, accomplishments of members and their families, articles pertaining to historical and contemporary issues, and tributes to its recently departed members and their spouses. In 1980 the fraternity chartered the Boule Foundation, not-for-profit private foundation that is supported by voluntary contributions from its individual members and their wives. It is an independent entity within the fraternity and selectively provides funding for student scholarships and social action programs and policy initiatives. 
Together with contributions from the fraternity, the Foundation has also provided financial support to programs and entities that address the broader common good, such as the Smithsonian Institute's National Museum of African American History and Culture. Further, to the extent possible and together with specific contributions from the fraternity's members, it has provided financial assistance for victims of unforeseen calamities of nature, such as Hurricane Katrina in 2005, which devastated the African-American community in New Orleans, and the 2010 major earthquake in Haiti. For over 100 years Sigma Pi Phi fraternity has served to enhance and strengthen the bonds of fellowship and professional support within its ranks. Additionally, and importantly, is the fact that its members have provided and continue to provide leadership and assistance to establish, sustain, and improve essential resources for fulfillment and growth not only in local black communities, but also in selected communities throughout the African diaspora. To learn more about black history visit blackfacts.com.